News at 6. Starting off tonight with some major security upgrades to the city's bike lanes after several riders have been killed by motorists. WGN's Jenna Barnes live in River North with the latest on it. Jenna? Ray and Micah, we're at Kinsey and Wells. This was Chicago's first protected bike lane, and it's protected by these little white plastic posts, something riders say does not do a whole lot of good when it comes to safety. This week, the city will begin upgrading this stretch of bike lane on Kinsey from Wells to Milwaukee, removing these posts and adding concrete curbs. This is something bike safety advocates have been calling on for years. In all, the city plans to upgrade 15 miles of existing protected bike lanes and add 10 miles of new curb protected bike lanes. Most of the work scheduled to be done by the end of this year with full completion next year. It comes after an especially difficult year of crashes involving bicyclists in the city. At least five bicyclists have been killed, including a 15 year old boy just last week on the southwest side. That danger is why advocates have been pressing for better protection. It makes it a lot easier for everyone to interpret and understand the street. So whether you're you're riding a bike or if you're driving a car, the concrete curb protected bike lanes are going to make you feel safer and make the street easier to use. Chicago's streets are scary and they're unsafe. Um, so I think that if we provide people these safe places to ride, we'll see more and more people do that. And that's good for our city, that's good for our climate, and that's good for people. And Kyle Lucas there was a victim of a hit and run while on his bike last summer, so he knows this danger himself. He says this is a step in the right direction, but the city still has a long way to go. We posted a full list of the bike routes slated for improvement at WGNTV.com. For now, we're live in River North. Jenna Barnes, WGN News. Thanks, Jenna. Disgracing singer R. Kelly will spend.